Hi. There are two main ways to export a piece from music, as a PDF file and as a music link. You can export from different places within the app. In the score view, under the features icon, press export to PDF. Under settings, you can include annotations, visible layers. When enabled, the annotations would be included in the export. Visible layers refer to the layers in the annotations. The layer that has the eye icon activated are the ones that would be exported. In this case, only layer 1 would be exported. Back to the PDF export. When include crop is enabled, the export would take into consideration the crop adjustments you have made. Export parts. In this piece, I have all the parts of the Tchaikovsky Symphony. By default, all parts are marked in V and are going to be exported. In case you want to choose just one of them, you can deselect all and tap the desired part or parts. When you finish, press done and choose the way you wish to export. Airdrop through another app, save to files and more. Another way to share this piece is by a music link. To do so, tap the features icon, piece details, export. Press send via email and tap the desired email address. The person receiving the email would then need to tap the open button on any iOS device that has music installed. An alternative way is copy shareable link, which would copy the link to this piece in the clipboard to be pasted and shared in your way of choice. You can directly export your piece from the library or from within a setlist by swiping a piece to the left and choosing Export. There are two ways to export a setlist. First is by swiping a setlist to the left and pressing Export. And second is after entering to a setlist, pressing the Export button. When exporting a setlist as a PDF, you will see we have one new column. Selected parts only. Selected parts refer to the last part you were at when leaving a piece. For example, I'm choosing the cello part, so by enabling selected parts only, the Symphony 6 piece would export just the cello part and not the rest. Another way to share a setlist is by converting it into a project, which is a collaborative environment that can be shared by multiple music users simultaneously. For more information on projects, watch the library tutorial. You can export a project similarly to sharing a setlist. The only difference is that we can export an individual piece from within a project only as a PDF file and not as a music link. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching.